Good morning. Um, so today is the eighth of September. It is five fifteen in the morning, and we're headed to Billings, Montana. So, oh, and I'm at BWI. Yeah, the dreaded airport no one wants to come to because it's so far. Um, usually people who like live out this way prefer trips out here, but as far as like us that are on reserve, nobody really wants to come out here because it's so far. So I was out last night with, with um, my cousin um, we had dinner together and we were out till like 11 o'clock last night and um, sure enough I checked my schedule as soon as I got in the car at 11 and they gave me a 545 show I'm like I swear I always get these early morning shows whenever I'm out late or I don't check um, CCS after 7 30 so I should have checked as soon as I met up with him we met up at around 8 30 last night to eat dinner um, as you guys oh well you don't know so yesterday um, they gave me airport standby so I was on standby from noon to four they didn't use me and then um, headed out and yeah then later on I ended up meeting meeting up with my um, my cousin so yep so that's how yesterday went um, I've had airport standby for they didn't use me so today is Sunday they Guys, this is Daquan. Hi. Nice meeting you. Um, okay, I forgot what I was saying. I'm going to be right back. Figure out where I'm going. All right, guys. So, I'm on the plane. Um, as I mentioned... So, um, like I said, I was out with my cousin, and um, it was 11 o'clock at night, and yeah, we checked CCS when I got in the car, and sure enough, I had a 5.45 a.m. show, just terrible. So I ended up um, just coming out here to BWI. I got a hotel. I had some points, so I was able to get a hotel by the airport. And then I just stayed there for the night and then called an airport shuttle here and parked my car there at the, at the hotel. So it's just the two day, today and tomorrow. So I will be back tomorrow night. Since we get in, what, like 10, 25? Mm -hmm. Something like that at night, so. This is my classmate Maggie. Hi. So we're both flying out of BWI, the dreaded BWI. Do you have, okay, question. So do you have any recommendations for when people get um, a flight out here but don't have a car? Preference not to, yeah. <laughs> but um, no, hotels are a good idea or yeah say if you get the trip early enough before trains start running mm. come sleep in the crew room mm. okay. because if you sleep in the crew room at least that gives you yeah, something sure. rather than having to pay a yeah. 50 plus dollar uber yeah because on holidays it can be over a hundred dollar i heard i heard it was over it can be like over a hundred dollars for uber so just throwing it out there guys because um, <clears throat> some people don't have a car when they come here and that is the worst thing about being based here in um, Dulles is you really really need a car to get to all three airports because we cover all three airports 
So, and Ubers can be extremely, extremely expensive, especially coming out here at BWI. Like, people have spent over $100 just trying to get here. And that's, like, <laughs> half of your trip sometimes, mm -hmm. <laughs> depending on how long the trip is. So, that's ridiculous. But, um, yeah, so like I said, I just drove here last night, and then I just got a hotel and then caught an airport shuttle. So, if you do have points, or your parents have points, or something like that, um, that'll probably be something good to kind of, like, keep. So that just in case something like this happens um, and you at least have enough time, you can, you know, um, get out here. So, all right, well, I'm going to go ahead and I'm galley today. So I'm going to go ahead and, oh, that's just my stuff in there. Oh, so that's okay. why I closed it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get my galley together. So, um, yeah, I will talk to you guys. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We're going to Denver. So we're going from BWI to Denver and then Denver to Billings, Montana. And then we have a 19-hour layover there. And then we report at like 8-something in the morning. I think it's like 8.30. No, 7. Sorry, our flight leaves at like 8.30. But we report at like 7.50-something. I don't know. Um, okay, maybe we leave it like 8.45 or 8.50. I don't know. But either way it goes. That's that. Um, Alright. Um, yeah, so... Yeah, I'll talk to you guys when we get there. All right, we are in the room. Guys, does this room look familiar? So we've been here before when I was with Sky West. So this is the infamous bathroom. My room was smaller last time though, definitely. And then there is the shower, the toilet. I'm assuming this is the closet. Yeah. All right. So this is the closet. I need to take that out. Put the suitcase on. And then we have the two beds here. Two chairs. A desk. Ooh, microwave and a refrigerator. And then, of course, we have the TV. And then let's see what kind of view we have. Hmm. Well, the mountains are pretty, so <laughs> yeah, that is the view. Okay, all right, so per usual, we are all gonna take a nappy nap, and then I swear we're like children, everyone needs a nap. Um, so yeah, we're all gonna take a nap. It's we are in Billings, Montana. And it is officially 1.08 p.m. And, um, yeah, so we're going to take a little nap. And then afterwards, I think I might go upstairs. They have, supposedly there's like a 
360 like view of the city or something upstairs um so yeah i think i'm gonna go do that um and i don't know uh, my classmate maggie said that she might like walk around or something and go to a baseball game so i don't know we'll see um yeah we'll see i don't know what i'm gonna do i'm not quite sure i haven't figured that out yet but it's not too much um by the hotel so you know can't really go too many places we don't have too many options but um but yeah we'll try and make the best of it we'll see what happens so yep i'll see you guys after my nappy nap <laughs> Just did my last minute checks. It's 7.23. Have to report downstairs at 7.30. So, let's head on down. Ooh, I had to wake my hair up, y'all. Everything needed to be woken up. Because when I sleep, I sleep. So we are in Houston, just came from Denver, and we have a three and a half hour sit. So our flight leaves at 6.05, and it's exactly three. Hi, how are you? 
and that's a wrap for this two-day trip we are officially in we got in a little late we left early but we had to go around weather so it made us get in late we're supposed to get in like 10 10 we got in like 10 25 so I mean it wasn't like that much later but technically it was late um, and the ride was very bumpy very bumpy the entire way so but yeah it wasn't bad I thoroughly enjoyed working with Maggie oh so I met one of you guys well not one of you guys but so I met a girl she was um, on one of our flights going to Houston and um, she was here for an interview so if you happen to come across this video Courtney good luck and I hope to see you in the friendly skies and yeah guys have a good night thanks yeah guys so with that being said thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye